Hello, today I would like to talk about physical item sort routines in Alma. Now, as you know, there are several places in Alma where we might be looking at a list of items, and it is now possible to quickly sort these items using sort routines, which can be configured to sort the items, let's say, by uh, volume and issue number, or by description, or by library. Um, items can now be sorted by any of these different criteria. And this comes to play not only in Alma, but also uh, in the Primo Get It tab, so that when your patron is looking at the list of items available for a given title, it will appear in the desired order, for example, by volume, then issue, then part. So let's take a look at how these sort routines come to play in Alma, and then we'll show how you can configure your own sort routines and decide where you want them to be in effect. Okay, so let's go into Alma. Now the first place in Alma where you can use physical sort routines is when looking at the list of physical items of a given title. So let's search for a title. And we have this title, the United States in World War II, and we see that there are several items. If we click here on items, we are taken to the list of items of this title. And in previous versions of Alma, you could sort these lists uh, from these columns. You'd have little arrows here, and if you wanted to sort by location, you'd click on the arrow. But now there's a tool that's a bit more powerful. We have here a drop-down list with sort routines, and you can select how you want the items to be sorted. So for example, right now they're sorted by library and location, so from graduate library to main. And these arrows determine whether it's in ascending or descending order. So now it's in descending order. And we can also choose to sort by different criteria that are defined in the system. For example, by description. And here we can see it's in descending order of description, right? Special, limited, okay? Descending alphabetical order. And I click here and now it's in ascending order. So one place where we can use sort routines is here in the list of items. Uh, another place in Alma where you can use sort routines is in the receiving department. So let's go into the receiving department. And we go into receive. And here, in the Continuous tab, under Actions, Manage Items, we're looking at the items of a PO line. And these items as well can be sorted using the sort routines available. Now you'll notice that I have a different set of sort routines available in this menu than what we've seen before. This is completely configurable. You can decide which sort routines are effective in which sections of Alma and which sort routine will be used in the Primo Get It tab so the patron will see the items in the defined order. Okay, so we've seen how to use sort routines. Now let's go ahead and configure our own sort routine. So to configure a sort routine, we go into Alma menu, Resource Configuration menu, and here we have under General, Physical Items Sort Routines. Here's the list of existing sort routines in the system. And we can add a new one, add sort routine. And we want this one to be by serial order. So first by volume, then by issue, then by part. It's possible for the sort routine to sort according to several criteria, as we'll see in a moment. Next. Now here I configure the actual criteria of the sort routine. So down here I have the available sort fields, and I can choose uh, any of these. We want the enumeration A, B, and C, volume, issue, and part, all three of these. Add to selection. And here I can see which sorts I've selected for the sort routine. So it's going to sort first by volume, then by issue, then by part. Now I can change this order around with these arrows over here. So, for example, now it's going to be first by issue, then by volume, then by part. But 
that doesn't really make sense for us right now so let's get back to the normal order and here you can also decide whether you want it to be sorted in ascending order or descending order okay so next and here we decide where this sort routine is in effect so we've seen uh, two places in Alma the acquisitions receiving items and we've seen the physical resource editor items list when we looked at the list of items of a given title and of course a very important one is resource management get it results this is what the patron will see in Primo so we want this new sort routine to be available in all three of these sections and here you can decide whether it's going to be the default sort routine so that when you enter the screen it'll be sorted automatically by our new sort routine so for example in the get it results we might want this to be the default sort by volume save and serial order we have a new sort routine in Alma let's see if we can put this sort routine to use so once again let's search for that physical title we looked at before and here we can see its physical versions now let's look at the volumes here um, you'll notice the one that's from the graduate library is volume 5 so we'll expect that one to be the last on the list when we use our new sort routine okay let's go into items and here are the items of the title currently sorted by library and location and if we select our new sort routine the one we've just created serial order we can now see that the items are sorted by volume number so the graduate library is at the very end now even though there's no column here for volume number Alma still can sort it by that criteria even though it's not here so this tool is actually a bit more powerful because it allows you to sort by additional criteria that are not in the columns so these have been sort routines for physical items um, we've seen where they come into place in Alma they also affect the Primo Get It tab and we've seen how you can configure and use your own sort routines and decide where they come into effect thank you very much for listening